when yeah. we were on commentary, you think Jin, Jin is overall the number one character. Yeah, I just think he has every tool. The and tools, if, right? If used in the right way, can be uh, explosive and destructive. Well, Nee is one of those guys that can prove your theory right. Let's see. Come on, Nee. <laughs> prove me right. But I think a fan favorite, Rang Chu. Let's see, in the Round crowd, one. get hyped for Rang Chu versus Nee. Let's go. <laughs> Now, one of the things that's going to be interesting, since this is two out of three, obviously it becomes a better chance for Rangchu. I mean, I think playing against Nii in a longer set is probably going to be a bit more difficult. Yes. And obviously, look at that. He's opening up with a huge lead. And just like that, it might yeah. be done for Josie. So, so much aggression here, but Josie gets huge damage off oh. the rage, but no, not going to get it. Yeah, but okay, one of the things we got to talk about here. If he does lose here, does he switch characters? And which character will he switch to? Because that's going to lock him in for the rest of the set. I, I'm going to have to say he's going to have to go to Kuma Panda. It has that, to be. Yeah, I would like to see that, and I think that's what the crowd would see. But does he falter and go for what the crowd wants, or does he try to play more strategic? I don't know. We'll have to see what he's going to do. Or if, even if he's going to lose here, but it's not looking good for him, Mark. Oh, yeah. And you know. And it's, it's, it's interesting because, you know, usually Ni a lot more methodical in his approach, but he's just rushing down Rangchu. Yeah, and Jin can do that. Jin can really get in your face and poke you down, but let's see how Rangchu is. No, oh, he's used up his resources now. Yeah, and that could have been a great comeback mechanic here. And it's funny, too, because we saw him go for it a lot in previous matches, and he ended up missing the combo afterwards. The back 1-1. One, one. Yeah. Yes. Okay, so quick two rounds here for Ni, looking super strong. Electricity flying everywhere. Let's see. Yeah, this is actually one of the new outfits, uh, thanks to the anniversary DLC of the game coming out. One of the story mode costumes actually looks really, really cool. It's awesome. Okay, down four. I mean, you could be annoying with down four all day, but it's going to take 40 of those to kill your opponent. Exactly. It does not do so much damage. I don't think Nii cares about that at all. But that Crash Dash 3 is annoying, however. Yeah, eventually he's going to have to be very, very careful because, you know, Josie, while she has some amazing mids, moves like down four. Oh, there it is, down four, too. Able to get it. Might be able to close that up. He's able to hit the wall. Bam, bam. Yes, it is. Nice double go. knee to the skies. And we are going to the next round here. Let's see if he's able to make more adjustments and be able to tie it up. That's what it is about playing against high level guys that like, like me. If you're given an inch, you got to take a mile. Oh, yeah. Nice with punish. And here we go, a counter hit. Oh, he dropped the wall standing three. Not able to get the follow up with the combo. That could have been big. And the low power coming in from Nii as well. This is not looking so good for Rangchu. That was a huge drop. Now oh, Nii playing again. This time dashing forward. Using that momentum, pushing and pressuring towards the wall. And this is again where Jin shines. He has so many uh, available frame traps. But never mind. Let me low parry that kick. His reads are on point right now. He's like he's in his head. Inception. Nice break, however. Oh, he went for the complicated wire throw too. Good break there from Rangchu. Oh, now man. what's he going to do? Oh, the down forward two threads that needle. It's going, going the other us. way. He, he has the rage drive. What's he going to go for? <gasps> oh! oh, and he was just patient as ever. Able to pull it off in the end. He's now up 1-0. Wrong two. What are you going to do? What's he going to do? Because actually, he started to make a nice comeback uh, there. I think he went to stage select. I don't think he went to character select. I think, he, I think he started to get more comfortable as the match went on. But yeah, no, he hasn't gone. And we're going to the party stage as well. Oh, man. This one, this one could be interesting because both of these characters excel, obviously, in doing damage in this particular stage. But when you get that floor break, you have to make sure you're near the wall as well. Yeah, it's true. But how is Rancho going to respond? And I always say that there's two ways you can respond after losing. Adapt or change your character. And it looks like Rancho has gone for the former. Yeah. And Which you know, it's not often that, I mean, Josie has so many amazing counter hit tools, but in this particular situation, Nii doesn't usually put himself in an in instance where he would get counter hit. Yeah. It's very rare. Nii playing very compact, it's usually he's either going to get blocked or it's going to hit. Yeah, absolutely. He's playing Scoot. super, super solid at the moment. So let's see, second match, and it is only first and two. One. Yeah. So, so Rangchu, last life, he is might locked get, in. We might get that dream winners finals that I was talking about earlier. Yeah. Let me see it. Okay, he's using that forward forward. Just back it up now. Not as aggressive as last round, but nice, nice match. Hey, we're going downstairs. Yes, sir. Oh, oh no, never mind. I think he pressed the wrong button. I don't know if that's what he wanted. Obviously not a damage option there. Yeah, but he got some, he's got uh, 50%. Let's see now. Me with that wall pressure. You see, that's the problem here is be being at the wall. All this pressure from Jin and Nii feeling very comfortable in this instance goes for the upward one plus two throw. Yeah, that throw would have broken the floor as well for big damage. Oh, this time trying to poke away at him. Nice. Using the jabs to keep him away. Yeah, but he's going to have to be careful. Oh, there's a hell sweep. Oh, that combo is sick. Oh, yeah. Goes straight up. Wants to get the best scaling out of it. Oh, he caught him, but he missed. Okay, how's he going to do it? Forward, forward, forward. Nice. Goes for the mid option. Catches knee ducking. And down forward four into the sand strategy is actually such a really great kind of check tool for uh, Josie. Yeah, definitely. 
one of the best moves that she has. And here we go, using that switch stance and the crouch dash, but nice low pipe from Nii. And Nii might be able to take this going downstairs. Down back 2-3, yes. Yes. What's the follow-up though? Is it Godfist? No, goes for the forward four. Yeah, he wants that wall carry. Keep him there, lock him down. Uh-oh, but now, why don't you fighting back? Oh, good jab. Uh-oh, gets the punish. That's an easy combo after that. Might be able to close it out here. Oh! oh. Okay. All right, the hesitation, but hey, I'll take it. Finish it too with a down forward four again, and a rank two completely turned it around. Yeah, and he might be able to tie it up here, and that's going to really put the onus on Ni. Is he going to stick to Jin, which I probably think he will. He's one of those stubborn players. I don't know. We stubborn might see someone else, but let's see if Ranch can finish it, though. Ni's super good at making comebacks. Nice. Four. And again, just kind of picking away, trying to find those shots. Knee looking for his own counter hits. Uh oh, big counter hit on the other side, again. but again! I can't believe it. You gotta have those combos. He just didn't dash in enough. Yeah. Now, go. speaking of taking an inch and a mile, Knee might be able to get away with murder here. But he doesn't break the normal throw. That is so weird. Yeah. Ugh. Oh, nice 2 4 follow up here. Goes for the hell sweep. No nice. one home. Okay, now what? Time. Oh, he was just out of range. He's gonna have to be careful. And the blocked hell sweep. Rank 2. Evens out the set. You know, Ni was taking some crazy risks there. Yeah, it looks like he kind of just turtled up a little bit too much. Like, the ra Ranchu making the right reads. The Crouch Dash 3 is working out a lot, giving him a lot of damage. He's going to character select. Of course, down back 4 with Jin as well, minus 13. Uh, full launch for Josie yeah. as well. Josie, one of the few characters that in the negative 13 situation will get a launch regardless. Make oh, all right. He's yeah. picking the character. You've seen him pick most of the time on stream this weekend. Steve Fox. Yeah, and talking to Nii before, he says that Steve does have some very strong matchups. Uh, Jin, for example, and it looks like Josie as well, he must think. Oh, yeah. And because it was a blind pick, that's what, what ended up us seeing that earlier matchup where it was Jin versus Josie. But now, I think because Nii is able to counter pick, this puts him at a huge advantage. Obviously, he has the confidence in this character for this particular matchup. Yeah, I guess uh, using Jin was good, and he was lucky he won the first match. So he's able to be in a position to counter pick. But let's see if Ranchu can overcome his Steve. Final match here to make it into winners' finals. Yeah, this could be big. Wow, he just opens up with a dash in while standing 2 1. Looking for the wall, gets it, but he doesn't get the follow up for an extra wall splat combo. Yeah, a bit of a weird angle there. Using that switch stance again, and Nii. He doesn't know what to do. Trying yeah. to catch it with that back one coming in. Oh my gosh, and the range of that. I don't even know how that hit. That was crazy. Such good timing from Rangchu, but doesn't get the combo though. Huge life lead though. Yeah, and it was just two instances. And one of the problems here with Josie inherently is she has to get you to make three mistakes. She's not one of those characters unless she hits the wall hard where yeah. she can make you guess twice and you're done. But good timing there from Rangchu. Takes the first round. Let's see what he does now. The Crouch Dash 3s have been working out so well on the down I can't believe it's hitting from like the maximum range. He knows his timing. His yeah. timing has been downloaded. And that's a great thing right now because if he's able to control when Nii is coming in, that's going to completely change the matchup and he's obviously turtling up a lot more. And that gives Rank the chance to be a bit more aggressive. Of course, back one always an issue. Nice stop. Nice and gets the follow up there with the Sonic Bang here. That's has cool. rage too. You're going to have to be careful. Oh, he got it. Is he going to miss it this time? No, he gets it. But the wall. Oh, the wall. He had a resplat. He could have done the knees. Oh, oh down one. It's so clutch there. And it could have been big. I mean, now it's tied up. But man, what if he was up two rounds? It would have been a huge comeback series. It would have been very, very, very bad for me. But manages to take the round. Clutch. Yeah, and he's still patient there, not falling for any of the tricks. And now blocking the down 4 2 finally. Uh oh, gets the follow up there. Nope. Wanting to change the momentum. Decided to use the Ray Drive a bit early, but the low parry there. Yeah, Ray Drive not working and a great low parry. Knee making the adaptations. This is it now. Set point to move into winners' finals. Rock's Dragon Knee. You know, Ronchu still feeling good, you man. We saw him get some amazing counter hits early on. Will he be able to continue that? Oh, this time yeah. going for the low option. He's really trying to find Knee and catch him coming in. And the problem, really, Josie, for her to really open up Knee, she's going to have to take some huge risks, a lot of which going to bring on a world of hurt if he gets blocked. Yeah, especially if you run into back one and get counter hit. It's such a risk. You can't be too aggressive as Steve. Uh oh, now pushing towards the wall. This is actually a pretty good position to have him in. You want to have him back to the wall just in case you do get those hits. You get way more damage. There you go. You see Nii just... Oh! Running. Here we go. There's a follow-up. Okay, break of the one plus shooter. That would have been a wall splat. Nice. Run yeah. to with a small life lead. Nice adjustment there. Trying to bait him here. Good way to close out the flicker jabs. Okay, nice low. Only 16 seconds left on the clock. What's he gonna do? Crash S3 again. Oh, he caught him with a big counter hit. He's gonna get the wall here too. It's gonna hurt big no, time. What is he doing? He went for the 10 count throw. Not able to get it. Rocket launcher. Ooh. Oh, there's no time left. 
Oh, oh you wasted it. He went for a jab string. Knee content, just stood there and he knew it was over. Yeah, that was such a close set. Rangchu.